Hello, hello. Uh, buongiorno, buongiorno. Welcome to the Terra Italica. Now, uh, it's last day, I believe this is the last day of early spring. So, yeah, just look it out of here. And uh, we have final preparations for of the seeding part of our work. So we have fertilizing. We have two wheat fields that we have to fertilize. And that's it. Um, I mean, there's a lot other work we're gonna be doing, but uh, concerning our field work. Just a second. So, as a first task of the day, we need to feed the animals and clean them. Uh, yeah, that's always gonna be a tough one because they require a lot of food. Okay, this is a bit bumpy road. Here we go, 666. That's a beastly amount. Okay, so we need to clean the pigs, we need to clean the sheep, we need to clean the cows. Let's feed them back this a little bit. Oh, here we go. Okay, now let's go to the sheep. Meet you there. Here we go. Sheep, sheep, sheep. I'm gonna check the food levels for each of them at the moment. Oh, I already fed them back. Okay, that's okay. So, they should be clean. Let's check the food uh, levels. Okay, they are pretty okay. Pigs are... Ooh, under half. Uh, we still have a couple of pellets. We, we should be able to feed them. Cows require some feeding, but yeah silage mostly that's gonna be a problem we're gonna have to have an early uh, mowing session so uh, what the problem is with uh, do we clean the cows cows are not 100% pigs are now 100% that's it so what we have a problem is that uh, I plow the fields and every time you actually plow the grass fields um, you will not catch the proper season for it if you catch my drift um, they require three growth stages and you only get two uh, per like until it's like anyway, anyway it's gonna be on the first or like second to last growth stage when we mow it so it's not gonna be full <coughs> excuse me it's not gonna be fully uh, grown so the amounts we're gonna get it's not gonna be astronomical stellar uh, the amount so we're gonna get is gonna be basic <laughs> um, but we still gonna have to do it because obviously cows already require more we'll we'll see how it goes anyway uh, I wanted to wait maybe with the mowing session but I don't think that's a reasonable choice because we need our own grass we need hay we need uh, uh, we need silage so we're gonna have mowing session. Uh, I will be doing mowing sessions on this field, uh, parking field. We usually I call it parking field, uh, where I usually park our machinery. Well, I will be parking our machinery because it's a grass anyway. Nonetheless, maybe if I get any suggestion, can I use it like as a straw or hay? What would be better in this case? I don't know. If you guys have any any ideas, like this is obviously not just normal grass. It's gonna be. Drive down, drive down, drove and on. So um, I'm not gonna be. It's not gonna be primary, prime grass, prime quality grass, but uh, it's gonna be grass nevertheless. So I don't know if I should make hay or silage from it. Okay, one down, one more here. Unfortunately, this is how the. Spring goes. You have seeding, seeding, a lot of seeding, and that's most of the thing you're gonna do. Just seeding, seeding, um, fertilizing a bit, and just uh, animal work if you have any animals. Like in this um, series, we got animals from the start because I wanted to go through the process of buying the bales, and uh, because when you start the game in seasons, you don't get the bales. Okay, let's check the levels first. Levels are okay. I would still put two pallets in there and we can actually grab two with this one. Yeah, like qu quality grab like last time when it was falling everywhere. But uh, I'm gonna try nevertheless. 
here we go. Now this is perfect. Uh, anyway guys, uh, it's a sunny day in Dublin. Uh, I'm recording this on Wednesday and it's we have a heat warnings. I never knew this is gonna happen. I've been living here for a few years now and uh, I became Irish already because I can't tolerate heat and now 28 degrees Celsius today uh, and some even say that it went up to 30 and for me it's crazy. It's just way 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 too much for everybody actually is so very hot in dublin very hot in ireland so hopefully you guys are okay and uh, okay straw and water so straw uh we're gonna have to get another bail grab straw uh we need a straw blower we're gonna use a new tractor for that and we need to feed other animals so we need water that's gonna use that's gonna be our lambo and uh oh there we go um silage silage to the pigs okay i meet you there so anyway really warm very hot in dublin uh hope you guys are okay hope you have a nice weather as well um i'm gonna be putting this silage bale straight here on the side like this there we go I think that's gonna be enough for the cows. Yeah, let's just keep it like that. Uh, we'll have something to do tomorrow. The next day, we're gonna have to clean them again and uh, feed them. Uh, now I'm gonna get a couple of straw bells. Just to check the levels. We have straw here, straw here. Yeah, I think one straw bell is gonna be enough for the blower. Straw blower. Mm, straw. If I was straw, where would that be? Here. Oh, we are running low on straw. It's no, 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 it's not too much. Don't worry, everything fine. I'm panicking for no reason. But in this, let's check the seasons. Here on this map, harvest of wheat and barley is early summer. I don't know if that's the case in other mods, season like on other maps, but the uh, geo mods. But here, it's like that. So. Um, I think it's a bit later. I'm not really sure. But anyway, mm, let's get this to the uh, straw blower and let's meet there, guys, with Lambo. Here we go. Uh, we have some straw in this blower, so I'm gonna be using that straight away. Uh, and we're gonna need another one, definitely. Okay, let's see how this works. No, it's not that one. Is it this one? I'm stuck. Oh, uh, okay. I think it has to be in the trigger. Let's see this. Yeah, I need to press I. Yes. Here we go. Here we go, cows. Bedding. Woohoo! They got everything. I'll just try to oh yeah this is swinging a bit yeah so let's get another bail in see you in a sec and here we go um we have our class scorpion and our lambo this is my not our new utility vehicle anything that can be done with this vehicle will be done with this vehicle Okay, let's check it out. Let's put it like this. I think it should fit fine. Fine is relative turn when you come to Uliki Gaming. Okay, let's finish the putting some straw to the cows. Yeah, this should be fine. Oh, there we go. 3,000 left here. I think pigs require like six, seven hundred or so. Uh, long breaking there. And yeah, I think that's uh, water, water. And uh, after water, we are done with the animals for today. Uh, tomorrow or days, I'm gonna skip recording um, feeding of the animals. It's not always the most fun thing to see, to watch. 
So I'm gonna try to keep it a little bit interesting. I mean, I can do this every day. I mean, I will be doing this every day. I just don't want to bother you guys with it. Okay, let's blow some straw. Wow, okay, that was a bit more than I expected, but that's it. Um, okay, let's get uh, <coughs> let's get the tanker. <laughs> Okay, let's get a tanker. Okay. This is horrendous. I'll just park it like this a bit. And just leave it here until somebody sees it. We're actually the ones parking this. Okay, we need to get the um, water tanker now. I don't know what's wrong with me. It's been a long day. I have a sunstroke or something. I really do apologize for this. Oh, anyway, let's finish it off so we can do some fertilizing. Uh, okay. There we go. Now let's go on this side. Where are the sheep? Sheep are here. The pigs are in a weird spot, yeah. Let's unload it here. Okay, sheep, I think they're gonna take a bit more water, so we're gonna have to go and refill. Okay, I'll meet you at the refill point. Yeah, the water trigger should be just around the corner here. Yeah, I think, I think, no, 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 it's just after the tree, this is a fuel. Uh, here, water hose, water hose. I don't know how long the water hose will be. What? Fill. No filling. I broke it again. I broke it. Here we go. There we go. It's filling up. 13%, 24. Anyway, this is a really nice little tractor. I love this Lambo. Uh, what do we do? We do this. <laughs> oh, we're feeling... Yeah, we probably should be working like this. <laughs> uh, no. Ah, we're done. Okay, let's go. Let's go. What do we have? We have sheep left and we have pigs left. So let's do this first. Uh, what is on our agenda? Yeah, next thing, next time we see each other, I'm probably gonna fertilize the fields off screen. So, I'll remove this UI. There we go. I'm probably gonna fertilize the fields, not to bother you guys with it, because I think we're gonna put a layer of fertilizer on all of our fields, and it's 18 fields. Minus three that are not harvest, uh, so not seeded, and minus this grass field, and but anyway, it's a lot of fields, so I'm probably gonna do it like fast, not to bother you guys, you know, like warm up for recording, and then we're off. But, oh, this is gonna give me some problems. Can we unload? No, we can't. Okay, now let's try to back it up. Should we get an icon? Yes, unload icon. Here we go. There we go. Piggies are getting food, piggies, cows, everybody's fed now. Okay, so we have a reproduction rate. I think, did we get a... No, we got piggy. We got, definitely got a piggy. We got one a day, currently, because it's early spring. We got every day... Almost the same for the for the sheep. We have 39 cows. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. This is gonna be really, really interesting. 
we have quite few animals, but we have a lot of fields. So most of this is gonna be uh, fine. We're not gonna require a lot of food. Uh, I, I mean, we're not gonna have uh, require extra food, but I will be. Um, I will be uh, keeping the bale purchase mod, so so we can buy any additional bales if need if needed. But uh, I don't think I'm gonna be selling a lot of uh, bales. I'm gonna keep it until the next year. Okay, this is a bad parking on my side. And here we go. Okay, uh, we need to finish uh, fertilizing these fields. This is wheat i'm thinking wheat we'll check later i'm gonna finish this uh fertilizing first this is wheat and across the street is barley those two fields require fertilizing and uh yeah uh, that's about it well most of our fields are already uh, uh done so we have two fields of sugar beets we are gonna have one or two fields of sunflower two fields of corn one for silage one for uh, food we have two f three fields of wheat two fields of barley uh what else no canola no canola we talked about it in the last episode um uh, i noticed that there's no canola in this uh, uh, in the first season you can't see it you can only see it uh, in winter so we will be seeding canola in winter I would, i'm looking forward to doing canola um i mean i, I don't want to say it's the least fun uh, it's the least profitable crop because it gives you only um it costs the most to seed i believe uh and uh, to sell you don't have huge yields and the sale price is like just around the sunflower price usually so nothing special about it you know you get the most from soya soy uh you, the most uh, grain you get from any crop is corn the most volume you get from any crop is uh sugar beets so so the so canola is just like there in the middle you know but we'll we'll do it not because we don't like it or just because we feel sorry for the canola <laughs> no we don't we love your canola um just because it's uh, part of this game uh, like same as forest or same as anything else well i'm still thinking about the mods industry mods we can implement uh, in this and we'll see which ones we have uh like we can uh, find that bio biogas oh sorry uh, biodiesel uh, mod so we can use canola to create our own diesel because we are using a lot like i said in second episode or first episode i used the whole thing of diesel just uh, plowing the fields uh, subsoiling the fields for so we can apply the fertilizer on them so we we use a lot of diesel anyway uh i'm just rambling along here I just came from work and uh, started recording and uh, I'm probably gonna do, hopefully I'm gonna do a few more recordings today for either this or uh, or the Valley of the Old Farm. And actually I'm thinking about the third map, there are so many maps I wanna play, like Old Slovenian Farm, uh, Under the Hill, uh, New Baltic map, there's this... Uh, a uh, Polish map I would like to try. I'm not even <laughs> I don't even want to start on uh the low oak the the west coast my favorite map the like all of this how how is a guy supposed to record all of this? I want to play so many maps I want to try everything but I don't just have don't have time to do this. I'm this is my hobby. I just started recording just because well, I'm playing it anyway and I talk a lot anyway, so why not? Just combine the two and hope you guys like it. You know, maybe someday I'm gonna make somebody's day. You know, like, or help relax. And because I, I like watching YouTubers like Dagger Win and Fridgar. Fridgar is amazing. I, I, he's one of my favorites. I can't choose which one is it, but I, I watched every Fridgar video. Not only the farming and the least of all farming. Like, um, not least of all, but like. I watch everything. You you really need to uh, find what relaxes you, what you like doing. Like I like watching farming videos, farming simulator videos. Oh, let's just turn around. No, let's pretend that nobody saw this. Okay, okay. My OCD kind of kicked in. 
No, I didn't have OCD, but um, I like it to be covered. So yeah, uh, I, I like Fridgar. I uh, comment on his videos. I try to participate in community, uh, everybody's community. I really appreciate. Dagarin is one amazing guy. I think he's one of the best uh, YouTube farmers out there, and uh, uh, I, I just love him. Like, uh, if anybody, like, I don't know anybody who doesn't like him. He's just a, such a positive and nice guy, and I really, really enjoy all, watching all his videos. It was actually like three, four years ago or so, and I actually, uh, while I was working, I had the extra time that I could do my job and watch YouTube videos. So I started watching farming videos like uh, Juan Rempel and uh, uh, small YouTubers, and I stumbled upon Daggerwin. I watched him, for, I will be watching Daggerwin now for four years, like Simulate, Landy Kid. Virtual Farmer. Virtual Farmer is such a great guy. I love watching his videos. I'm sorry about this. And here we go. Uh, sorry for rambling this long and sorry about this, guys. But uh, I just got caught in a moment and I just started talking. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this one, guys. I really, really did. And uh, it turned out to be more fun than I expected. And, you know, I really wanted to record something. I'm gonna run, run, run. And let's climb on the tractor. I don't know if this is something that we would allow to do. But anyway, um, there you go. Uh, feeding a little bit uh, of animal, a little bit of feeding animals, a little bit of fertilizing, and we are ready. Uh, it's mid spring soon. Mid spring, guys. Uh, proper work is going to be done soon. And uh, yeah, uh, see you in the next one, guys. See you tomorrow. Bye bye. Oh, sorry, uh, subscribe, like, you know, all that nice positive stuff, uh, do, do it, do it, no, just in case, you know, okay. Uh, have a nice evening, guys, and see you in the next one.